Okay. Last season of Mad Men, last chance at the Emmys for that show at least. Yeah. Tell us about the experience of just wrapping up the show. Well, you know, I started season five and about six weeks after I started, Matt told me the end. So we were always working towards that. So getting there was just surreal. It was really, um, it was really amazing as we got near and near. And, and Matt had such a specific vision so early on for those final moments with Dawn and for the commercial. I still am scared to say it out loud because we had to keep it secret for like four years and everyone did. Right. And you shot it the whole last season, like the summer before, so yeah. I don't know how you kept it secret that long. I know, and then there was like, it was exactly, the, so season, the first part of the season seven aired, and then the second part was like a year later, and I could never keep in my head what aired, and what hadn't mm -hmm. aired, and whether people knew who got together, and who was going to end up where, so it's a relief to be able to talk freely about it. Anytime I would interview an actor, they couldn't remember what they, what, what they could say and what they couldn't it's say. It's totally easier yeah. just to say nothing. I remember Mac going, like, nobody Google the Coke ad. I don't want it to go up and Google and everyone to ask why. <laughs> we were like, I don't think we can make it go up and Google, but he was convincing me. And now this is your last time at the Emmys for this show, so what, yeah. what's that emotion like? Well, it's nice because, like you said, we've been done for a while, so it's like a reunion a little bit. I'm seeing all the writers right. from the room and people I haven't seen in a while, so it's bittersweet. Well, good luck on Sunday. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to meet you. you too.